Hello everybody, welcome back to my Stormbound stream. Tonight I'm going to play a deck that was uh, requested by Gil. He really wanted me to play, I think this deck specifically. I don't think I've changed anything on it. So I will remove my deck list for now so you can see it better. Basically the Heart Guards combined with Fort of Ebonrock. That's basically the finisher. And with First Mutineer and Ubas. I can uh, deal damage until uh, half guards can finish the job. And for the rest is basically a lot of early game to survive against aggro. And well, Gift of the Wise with... Well, basically Gift of the Wise also for more aggression. I don't have any uh, free booter to give any cards. So eventually this deck uh, will run out of steam. But it makes it easier for me to sync with Gift of the Wise and uh, Freebooter. Now I can just discard Gift of the Wise once I have enough mana. We will come to late game. And otherwise it will be really easy to trigger my North Sea Dock. Early game as well. Well that's basically it for now. I haven't tried this deck at all. I don't have any experience with Half Guards. I've upgraded it to level 3 for now. So it's... Basically, oh, let's put that one back in. Basically, it has gains plus five strength when used bordering a structure in case a Fort of Ebon Rock to walk inside his base. Otherwise, I can use it defensively to clear out uh, early games. Uh, yeah, it would be nice to have it on level 4, but obviously all the cards will be have a better win weight on a higher level. So let's just go. I will name on my deck list again. So people can see what I'm playing. Salakate, Diamond 1 is protecting the Sacred Slot. Let's see how I fare. I think I have a fairly good start. No, not really. I don't really like to play Summer Militia right now. I would play Summer Militia. Fort of Ebon Rock. I think I will play Summer Militia. We'll recycle Westwind Sailors for a 1 or a 2 drop. Next turn I can go Rhyme Links and Fort of Ebon Rock. But it doesn't help at all. Let's just play it. Next turn I can rhyme links here, rhyme links there. Most likely I would prefer to go right here. So my Fort of Ebon Rock can soak up a lot of damage already. Right, that's a lot of stuff already going in. First Mutineer and North Sea Dog might be a good combo for next turn. For now, yeah, let's this guy walk in front as well. I'll just continue what I was actually planning on to do. It's also good to have Ford of Ebon Rock at basically four strength or below four strength. So green prototypes cannot uh, exchange with it that easily because structures don't give or green prototypes doesn't give its buff to a structure. Oh, this is nice. Now basically I want to recycle first mutineer, I imagine. I don't want it. Every card I get can be played. Hopefully for half guards, I think that's the most expensive, or Ubas. This is also pretty good. Let's play this guy right here. We'll play my North Sea Dark in front of this guy. Yeah, obviously won't play North Sea Dark before. Uh, 
Hey, MK, or Melkover, I mean. <laughs> Just take my own name. Thanks for watching again. If you enjoy it. Playing another deck from Gil, also a Discord player. Looks like he will play it right here. Ooh, level four, true shot post. That is annoying. Basically, this is five. I actually don't want my green prototypes. This is really good. So let's hope we'll get lucky and this one gets killed. Yeah, that was really lucky. But hey, I won't deny it. Sometimes the odds are in my favor as well. Yeah, for now on, it's for him really game to climb back. It becomes so difficult. Because he just invested so much in his true shot post. But it's really good to know that he has a true shot post. It can be really problematic to deal with. Uh, I don't want my green prototypes. But oh, that's a nice... Uh, This will spawn a two strength, so he won't get any. And I can place my Fort of Ebonrock right there. Or we'll place it right here. So I'll place it. Let's first see what it's doing because it goes behind it. It becomes really annoying. Like this, my half guards can be placed on top of it and walks inside his base. Might be a good one. And otherwise, just so much already. No cover. Is the stream uh, doing a bit better today? Just wondering. Ooh, that's quite a lot of guys getting in here yeah half guards isn't really good at the moment it's only 10 mana really afraid that i get my north sea dog i think i will be a bit aggressive like this Now he actually knows that I'm playing this guy, so I need to be a bit careful. Play it in a triangle. See, there it is. Ah, don't need my gift of the wise. I have two cards I want to recycle. <laughs> what do you mean with the? Uh, if you write your ID, I don't think my chat is working. All right, this is annoying. I actually don't want to. Yeah, it is not getting any better. I 
and hope to uh, get this one recycled. Ah, happy at least it's not behind one of my uh, Fort of M rocks. With a few, right? You can also add me, right? It's in my uh, screen. It's uh, here, the button 10,000A18445. Feel free to add me. Mm, I have a lot of. It's basically 11, so that's nice. They won't have any thing left alive. And I basically want to play all my cards before Ubas, sadly. Well, this is just going to be really hard for him. Basically, I get my half cards right now. Oh, that's already let's play. Wow, that guy is playing in rogue soldiers. It's like the weaker Ubas. Oh, I will need to do my quest as well, so I will just go for it. Yes, the chat book is working again. Noise. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. So that's why I have it on here. I want to do more uh, friendly matches. Or people just uh, want to challenge me. Sometimes when I'm in the train, people just uh, challenge me when I'm grinding my quest. It's fun to... Uh, actually play someone who's interested in what I do playing against instead of some random stranger online boom well here it is diamond rank one my legendary what will it become dr. Mia that's pretty sick because I uh, like to play with structures I think I have dr. Mia on level 3 right now so getting her on level four would be really, really, really good. Yo, my cover, you are at it. Let's see what my, ah, uh, oh, well, do it later. Let's try this deck again for Gale. You are at it, Mr. Milk cover, cover. Let's update my score. Let's see. Now I need to uh, change my name as well because I'm not actually climbing to become rank one again. Can't wait to uh, receive my uh, end of the month uh, rewards. That will make a huge boost to some of the decks I want to play in the future. Actually, I want to play uh, dragons. Ironclad Dragons. And I want to experiment with Galaxy. Frog Galaxy for uh, Shadow Fan. I think those are uh, can be quite funny decks. Bit scared of the Galaxy one because it's really, really slow. So I don't think it will uh, let me survive long enough. But maybe with Toxic Sacrifice on a high enough level. For example, level 5, 
I can sacrifice my toads and all my other stuff to kick some back. Mm. Yeah, it's only five strength, right? Rhymelings can do anything with it. So I'll recycle it. So I want to go for my gift of the wise. He is a swarm. We'll play somewhere in here. Make it a bit more difficult for him. But it's annoying. I think I will recycle half guards. Play for the Vemrock. So next turn I can play Ubas with some other good stuff. Should have played my Nerdsy Dog behind my Lava's Herd. It's uh, basically a bit of a misplay. It might be that it suffices at the moment. Oh, well, I'm just gonna let him soak it up. Level 5 Swarm Callers. It's gonna be a tough match if all his cards are on high level. Oh, that guy. Why is he so hateful? Well, I want my summon militia. I think we'll play Westwind Sailors now because it's worth 8. Combination with uh, Ubas. It's level 4. Level 5. Well. If only this was <laughs> level 10 uh, or level 5 done three damage oh well that's probably never gonna happen play so many decks i would ever have enough fusion stones to get a level five legendary all right this is really hard to beat I basically don't want green prototypes. It's never gonna do anything. Well, well basically a lot of chances is good. I need to soften it up a bit. Otherwise he can with like uh, heralds him, kick my back. It's basically over already. Well, you never know. If I can recycle this, get something really sweet, like half guards, clean stuff up. Play give recruits, not see dark defensively. I'm just afraid he's like pushing it, potion of growth, and then the first mutineer is uh, kicking it. Ooh, that's a really weird position. I need to recycle this guy. I need to play Gift of the Wise because I want my North Sea Dog. It's a weird position. If he played, for example, the, I don't know. Well, I want my Rhymelings to survive, but they actually they won't. It doesn't really matter much. I will play it here defensively. So next turn it will be also defending my baseline. Oh, this is nice but now it's gonna be really tricky getting through nine you won't do that you'll just focus on this spot right here I 
Oh man, I really, really, really need something. Yeah, this is so over. If I do this, I might get a kick with Fort of Ebon Rock next turn. Get a lot of uh, AOE damage. So now, if he cannot kill me, half guards will kill him if he doesn't clean up these two guys. But there's him. Or Forgotten Souls is just enough. Haha. <laughs> His dream sniping is indeed. Uh, I haven't decided about music yet. I uh, basically haven't looked at it at the moment. But it's still on the my to-do list. Oh, this is annoying. Cause I really want to kick his ass. This is also a nice combo. But it's really tricky. I can go for Gift of the Wise, recycling this. Keep my first mutineers. If he makes a mistake of attacking here or uses his restless goat that he can kill, he gets 5 HP. Yeah, I will try to test it eventually with the music. As people are saying about the DJ. Also, looking into it if my Stormbound background music can be added without adding all the other stuff. Ben Heralds. I don't think this guy plays Forgotten Souls or Herb. Him. But this is a misplay. This is definitely a misplay. Well played, mister. I don't know why he's playing so defensively. He should scatter around a bit more. Noise, noise. Mogil, this is a pretty good deck. some gold, need the monies.
All right. Oh, I want to keep my gift of the wise. Don't really care about hard guards at the moment. Let's just play this guy. This is a bit more annoying for him to deal with. Hmm. We'll recycle it. We hope for Westwind Sailors. This is pretty okay ish. This is a nice spot, so this will kill it. And then for my Ubas next turn, I will get another uh, unit type. Hopefully this will also survive. And then I have Rhyme Links as well. So then I have four different unit types. So this guy shoots for eight damage. Oh nice. If he did didn't do that, then this will be cleaned up as well. I will keep my Ford of Heaven Rock because it's really good. I think I might clean this up at all. Alright, pew pew pew. Well, now it's basically uh, annoying for him to deal with. Crunchy Toad Man. What do you mean by Crunchy Toad Man? The battle stage, or? I don't know why he's playing it there. Oh, this might make sense. It cannot be removed at the moment. It's nice that it doesn't go forward. So my summon militia will be a bit more in the back. Oh, let's wave to him, say hello. This isn't that much. It becomes basically three. Well, I don't want to have green prototypes. Doesn't do any. Yeah. Cleans that up. This is actually really nice to have. But let's just see where this guy lands. Play this guy more defensively as well. This is safe. Because this will kill that. Need to be careful. This becomes 5. So it's easy for him to deal with gifted recruits level 5. But if he gets this, it costs 8. Doesn't care if you always herald him at the moment. Because then it's 5 mana for 7 damage. And then I can clean up everything. Oh, interesting. Confinement level four. All right. Well, it works. I think I will recycle half guards. Can rhyme links right here. So it cleans it up as well. It's five, six. Get a lot of hurt would be insane or gift of the wise.
two, five, seven. Well, actually, one, two. Oh man, what I'm doing. Not thinking at all. That's really stupid. I don't know what I thought. Just missed so much opportunity. Well, it was uh, stupid to quit being five and then my North Sea dog could get a lot of value out of it. These men wanna to less, otherwise could poison of growth. So it becomes 12. Yeah, basically I will recycle gift of the wise now. I need to be careful at the moment. Because now I'm at 8. It's basically anything that enters my baseline will be destructive. But now I can destroy this. I haven't seen any Vindicators, but that might still be happening. This is basic two, seven, eight. I will play this guy really annoyingly. Cause then he needs to attack one of these guys. If I play this here, hopefully next turn. I can use half guards. Nope. Just hoping for half guards and uh, for the Venom Rock combo. I actually don't have space <laughs> to play it at all. From God, if I edit my last win, I don't know. Cannot remember. Yeah, basically, what is he going to do, man? He's just messing up. It's five damage in. Sadly, I cannot do anything, so I'll just recycle this. For now, I just need to make sure that I won't die to anything. And it's playing as many cards as possible. Now this line is completely safe, I think. Text this, and he can move Shady Ghoul right here, and he still needs to clean this guy up. Or he just played his uh, double box and Forgotten Souls. Oh, all right. Now I actually really am sad that I just lost all my two movement guys. 
Gift of the Wise doesn't do anything anymore. Just need to recycle everything as soon as possible. Once you can use this guy to move forward. And I still need to be careful that my baseline is protected. But I also want to have some pressure on his side. I cannot block anything of this. Maybe stupid. Because now if he can forward this, he can shady ghoul this and then Well Well played. I can't do anything about Suri, Lord of Life. Would have been better if I had my Uvas. Since I pinged him for two or for the two times. Oh well, it was a nice game. And likes to see people using a uh, Suri Lord of Life situation like this. Ooh, it's stream sniping mail cover. Hello. Now I need to win. The pressure is on. Nice, that's really good against Shadow Fan. Because this area affects basically uh, three by three. Ooh, Reign of Frogs level 4. That becomes only 2 mana. Shouldn't be happy that it's happening at a moment like this. Well, I need to recycle as much as possible. I will go for Westmint Sailors for my Ubas. Hopefully, I will get a turn with the Gift of the Wise. But I'm a bit scared if he plays this card. It's a high chance he plays Cluxy or he plays Kindred's Grace. Level 4 Venomfall Spire. It's also scary. Let's recycle that card as soon as possible. Yeah, this is really annoying. But this is still a lot of damage. So let's do this. Hopefully it will kill. Ah, just, just not enough. All right, this is really good. So basically only potions one unit and he cannot get it unless he has like the marked as prey. This is almost destroyed. Can hit it with first mutineer. Rhyme links, first mutineer, lawless hurt. Oh he's gonna Well that's really bad for me.
So this structure needs to be destroyed. The sad thing is now my half guards won't do anything, but I don't get it yet. So that's nice. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, still have things more cover can do. Thank you, Feed Me Pizza, for following me. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Feel free to uh, have a chat with me. Shipping in the damage. I haven't seen the subscription activity. Seems like it isn't working, just like Chad it didn't. What's going on with Tish? Ah, this is pretty good. I need to kill him really, really soon. So I will just go for it. Alright. Basically, I will need to play Gift of the Wise if what my North Sea Dog played. Do it like this. This is super aggressive. I think I need to be. If you play skin, there's grace. And he makes it for himself really hard as well. I don't know, this seems really a bit aggressive. But I really want to win. <laughs> if only two damage comes in, then my half cards can do the trick. Or basically have these two guys for 11 as well. Well played, well played, mister. But I can still cannot win. This is really difficult. Now he needs to remove quite a lot. He needs to remove this too. And now I have like gifts roots and frostlings. Can't think that he can deal 12 damage to my base right now. He might be able to remove 14 damage right here. With a lot of forward movement. Well, feed me pizza. I don't know if you have seen uh, the pop-up of uh, following. I didn't think it worked, but thanks for following me again. If 
be free to uh, chat in uh, in Twitch. All right. This way he can survive again. Uh, need to destroy that building. Two, five, eight. I think I will just play everything. And hope for my Ubas or my half guard. This will also give me something. Right. <clears throat> Just the new bus will be enough. Ah, still again. Still not getting it. Well, he needs to remove these eight, so that keeps him occupied for a moment. Like, oh, nice. Well played. This will still survive. Emerald towers. Pretty chic. Well, let's try to recycle this for something better. I need to do my summer militia as well. So many unit types at the moment. Well played, Mr. Melkover. Well played. Well played, well played. It's nice to uh, see each other. Don't think he stream sniped at all. It's just. Fighting his best with Emerald Towers. Have to respect uh, him for using a card like that. Not even level 5 or anything. Pretty sick. He doesn't uh, hear me talking because he muted it because he didn't want any spoilers. Let's see if we can go another win. Stack is working pretty well. A lot of guards already pretty high level, so only the half guards is something new in the deck. It feels like I'm going to uh, match up against the bot. <sighs> Do any of you guys also play other games besides Stormbound? Just wondering uh, what you guys do all the time in your life. I don't know what I want. I don't want to play for the Webrock in the corner. I also don't want to play first mutineer. I think I will recycle North Sea Dog. Be a bit aggressive. Nice. Well, it's a nice card, but I like my Gift of the Wise a bit more. 
Ah, you didn't fail, Melkover. I think you played pretty well. And you also played with uh, Emerald Tower. It's pretty sick. It's a hard card to uh, utilize in a deck. I think Shadow Fun is pretty decent with it. I always thought of Ironclad using it. But with a swarm of Shadow Fen with Toads, you can uh, protect uh, some of your uh, tokens. I will recycle Gift Recruits because I don't know, I just want to have something. And Ubas into Rhyme Links. Gift of the Wise is pretty sick. Let's just clean it up for now. You only have failed once you uh, had, for example, all your cards on level 5. Now you were just playing your best. It's a pretty decent fight. And you were also unlucky with the, with the potion guy. Oh, this is really good for me. Another unit type. Like with your, uh, how's that guy called? That sucks out potion of uh, drains. Of cards, I don't want it yet. Ooh, this is really, really, really good. Yeah, it, it's really difficult. I think I will play it right here. So I clean up all his units. That makes the most sense. Don't want anything of him to survive. Like boosting Elixir on level 5. It's 12, it's 300% mana strength ratio. Yeah, potioning is really difficult. I, just, I also tried it, I think, a few weeks ago. And well, you have to have like every card needs to be there on time as well there's a small update with the cards that makes it easier Alright, let's play a bit defensively. Basically, he wants to clean this up. This is a bit less aggressive. It is for me impossible to destroy it because I just recycled my green prototypes to kill this off into half cards. And with Ubas hitting him twice. Well, that's unlikely. Ooh. I need to clean this guy up really fast. Don't want this guy. This guy is really good. Oh, for now, we'll just do it like this then. Yeah, only once. At least everything is gone from him. It becomes difficult. If he doesn't block this half cards, that's a big chance of getting played next turn. It is also really nice. It takes 11, so I can play all my cards. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Nah. Mm. 
<laughs> this is annoying. I do want... Maybe I should trick it. Now it's becoming really tense for him. And I still have my Ubas, hopefully in the next few turns. So if I just clean up everything. He will play his sharpest exiles. I just get a lot, don't get a lot of units alive. And he's clearing, so that's a good sign. It's fine if he hits me. Oh, he lets this live. Oof. Let's be greedy. Let's do something nice. I think his Wind Wakers won't recycle that fast. And there they are again. Most likely if I recycle something, it's a big chance I get my Ubas. And he has no units on board. So it becomes tricky for him. Nice, that one's killed. I don't want to have a lot of units on board. Oh. Let's play this out as this deck should be played out. Pretty chic. Right, four more spells. And I get my five rubies. Goes pretty well, right? Goes pretty well. Talk to me, yeah. Got my legendary from reaching rank one. Really happy if I can upgrade Mia to a level where she's triggering surrounding structures. I currently still have it on board ring. It makes a huge difference in some cases. Right, who's going to fight against me? Let's get this game on. It's nice, somebody watching from Malaysia. Thank you for watching, hope you enjoy it. How's the weather? In uh, the current deck I'm playing, if you want to change Ubas, let's have a think about it. Basically, we don't want to replace it. It's 
is better. Ubus. Let's have a look at my own deck list. Uh, I like Rock Workers. I think Rock Workers is really funny. Also with hard cards in combination. And it has a lot of uh, value as well. So I will go with Rock Workers. It's also a 5 mana slot. Doesn't interfere there with the North Sea Dock. Alright, let's first play this guy. You can always choose to play Ivan Rock right here. I will just go greedy. It's fine. Like this. Yeah, I think I will also play that version of this deck sometimes. Might be really fun. Alright, let's kick this guy. Keep first mutineer. I don't know what I was thinking. Let's recycle this guy. Oh, I never seen this. Playing rhyme links, recycle, get a rhyme links. Interesting. Well, for now, I'll just play this guy a bit aggressive. Hey, Resus, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy it. Are you, uh, by coincidence, the guy from uh, Malaysia? Someone from Malaysia is watching. Added a new uh, extension to my chat. So below you can see where people are coming from. Don't think it's actually working that well or people have opted out. There are only three people watching and there's says like there are six viewers. This way, my guess it boost becomes really strong. Oh, nice. Only five mana, but still, North Studio gets triggered. That might be worth it. I think I will be greedy and recycle all this herd. I'll just attack this if I hit it a few times. Lose everything. At least he won't get any further. Which makes it a bit safer and now he's most likely just dead. Noise. Well played, Mr. All right, five against one. One more spell, and then everything. Ooh, it's a human. It's a human named Paul B. Thirty-nine. Hello, Mister. Playing winter packs as well. So let's see what he has come up with. I think green prototypes for the Vibrock is pretty nice. He has a really bad start. 
only fell for there's level four as well. Obviously, I will use my fortified mineral rock here to soak up that damage already. That makes it a bit harder for him to use green prototypes into it. I think I will just play these five mana cards and wait for Gift of the Wise next turn for some big plays. Maybe Ubas with a lot of unit types staying alive. Uh, yeah, if I want to change my quality, it's still unsure. I think if you become a partner, it is something uh, for sure. Yeah, let's finish my turn first. Uh, basically, you became like currently I'm just a streamer at a certain point and the only thing I still need to become an affiliate is 50 followers so if I reach 50 followers I can get a bit more official streamer Ooh, it's annoying what kind of level is it level 4 oh, that hurts so if that happens I become a bit more an of of uh, I will become an official streamer So I will become a, an affiliate streamer and then the odds of me getting the way to change uh, stream quality will increase but it's still uncertain and once I become a partner but then you become really really big then you need like an average of 100 viewers or even more and for a really long time and you have to stream almost on a daily basis but then at that point you can get uh, almost always different video qualities so I think the biggest step for me forward is getting 50 followers and uh, make sure I will still do for all the requirements. Oh, this guy also has a level four. This guy basically has a lot of high level cards. Well, I don't want to play Lawless Hurt. Just miscalculated a bit. This is pretty good. Starting to do some damage on his face. It's nice as well. Getting my Fort of Ebon Rock as well a bit further. Helps a lot. <laughs> yeah, let's hope for that. Only eight more followers. But it's getting a. Uh, it's not going up that high anymore. I think most of the enthusiastic people who actually want to see uh, Stormbound on Twitch already uh, have been following it. So I don't know how much more I will get. I might also be thinking about streaming different games, but not sure about that. Well, that's just not here. Then I will be really sad.
this way it won't get my fort of heaven rock destroyed and this is just nice to have a bit more pressure get more easily to his baseline at the moment i played the like an old school doom game once but then there's also weren't any people watching because <laughs> nobody knows it's already streamed and the whole uh, stream went uh, shit because it was getting a different resolution like 800 by 600 and my streaming software was just breaking apart <laughs> i think it will be nice eventually i want to switch to basically a lot of games i play because it's enjoyable when people uh, are watching and you can talk about the games it comes a bit more social ah this guy I think I will be go really aggressive. Let's hope he cannot kill me in the next turn. If something like this hits, get my first mutineer as well. Maybe even recycle this into a half guard. Also play a lot of my uh, on my Nintendo Switch. So also looking into buying a. Uh, capture card so I can actually stream the games I play on uh, the switch and what I've been lately been playing is a bit of Zelda Breath of the Wild and Hollow Knight actually like Hollow Knight as a lot of people play it on Steam or whatever but I use it to play in the train Don't destroy it. Yeah, this becomes really tricky. This is basically nine. This is annoying to deal with as well. I will go really aggressive. So hopefully my first mutineer can finish it off. Place it right here and even remove this. I most likely still have this guy. Nice. Rhyme links, Nubas and first mutineer. Gives me a lot of forward movement. What kind of games would you like to uh, watch as well, Mel Coffer? Like I've also played a lot of Hearthstone in my days. Already eight people watching. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Oh. Yeah, what are the odds? Think I will play super greedy. Basically, you need to recycle this. I 
Oh. Whew. Just in time. That was really close. <laughs> oh, Starcraft. That would be nice. I think I'm a bit slow for Starcraft. Hearthstone. Hearthstone. Pronounce it a bit better. Yeah, Starcraft would be nice. I think I will go for the uh, arcade -y, uh, stuff. Otherwise, I will be in uh, Cardboard League, Iron League, the bottom league. I think I was eventually somewhere in the Gold League when I was playing Hearthstone or uh, Starcraft. It was quite fun. All right, victory. Yeah, I think it's always hard to play games with everybody likes. There are so many games out now at the moment. But anyways, I think it's going pretty well. But there's uh, tomorrow I have to get to work. I have to do some stuff before I go there. Clean up the house in Shizzle. Well, I uh, want to say uh, nice for Gil for his asking me to play this deck it's been pretty well pretty good i mean my score is 6-1 on diamond rank one so that's uh, a really neat score for it so thanks uh, for providing with the deck and it was a pleasure to play with it if everybody else wants me to play a deck feel free to uh, add me or show me talk to me give a deck list and i will have a look at it get feedback on the deck and uh, well, if it's fun to play, and basically I play almost all the decks, I will play it. For now, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, well, if you want to see more, you can always follow me on uh, on Twitch and on YouTube. You can follow me here. And uh, if you want to see all the VODs, I will post them there, so you can also uh, watch them back. And uh, well. Thanks for uh, for watching. See you guys later. Bye.